Hello and welcome to another plan with me. This week I'm planning for the week of the 19th to the 25th of August in my classic happy planner with the vertical line layout. And I'm using a planner face kit today. This one is called Peonies. So this is a little freebie that you got with it. Here's your full boxes, some sidebar items, date covers, your half boxes, quarter boxes, bill dues, some check boxes, some flags. Okay, you're coming to do your planner. So my little one's just decided she's coming to do her planner with us. So just bear with me two seconds. You got the unicorns there, use the unicorns. Okay, so you've got your headers, your little things, some glitter headers, you've got your full boxes, checklists, some functional icons, your washi with an extra full box. So yeah, that is the full kit. I'm going to pop my insides out and we'll get into planning. Yeah, I'm planning, you're planning. So to start off with, I'm going to put down the washi along the top. I'm going to use both of these pieces because it's just really, it's so pretty. I love this kit. I'm going to say that an awful lot during my planning life, I think, but you just, you will find that you fall in love with so many beautiful, pretty kits. And of course I love it. I wouldn't have spent my money on it if I didn't love it, but anyway so let's lay that down i want to give it a bit of a space at the top so i don't end up with a situation like i had last week where i'm going over the top and then i've got to try and pull it up and i was ripping the paper and all of that so oh, crowley scratch you yeah uh school holidays still so um my little one is planning with me at the moment um she's got a ton of kit leftovers and a bit of paper, so she's planning. Yeah. Oh, that's so pretty. Thanks, You're welcome. I'm just going to put that right up against the bottom bit there. I'm not usually a floral person. I don't tend to buy floral kits, but I just saw this one and I don't know what it was about it. I just had to have it. It was just so stunning. Where's Crowley gone? Where's Crowley gone? He's eating biscuits, I think. Hmm? That's that I'm going to take my sticker. I'm not taking your stickers. Huh? I'm not taking I'm your stickers. I do love... I'm very tentative about buying kits from shops because you never know what the print quality is like and you don't know what the you know digital I know online what you see on the screen isn't always what you get so I'm always a little bit apprehensive and I'm like so when I buy stuff from a shop I'll only ever buy one item to start with and I tend to go for a cheaper item because that's how you can tell where people's quality lies. If they don't put in 100% on their cheaper items, why should I waste my money on the more expensive ones? So, um, I do have things like that where I'll just buy really cheap little things and then go back to the shop a thousand times if I love their stuff. And then I've bought Daddy cheap things and they've been one. awful so I've not bothered to buy anything else. Oh, are you this? Yeah, I'm doing this. No, I'm not doing this. No, you're not doing this. I'm not doing this <laughs> You're doing this one. No. no, that's your planner though. This is my planner. Um, the only downside to this kit is it doesn't come with any date dots. I have pulled out some date dots from an old kit of mine. So I'm just going to use date hearts on it for the date covers. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh. Um, 
So last week I tried to do a spread using only what was in the kit because it was such a big kit that I used. Um, I'm probably going to be pulling in some bits from other shops, but I will try and use most of what is in this kit to uh, get my planning done. Have you got your camera now? Yeah. So <laughs> that daughter's just gone to get her camera so that she can film her planning because, you know, she's planning too. You've got to plan with a camera apparently. So, as I said, I've just pulled in these little date hearts from my shop to use. You gonna take a picture of me? Go on then. It needs batteries. Oh dear. Daddy, gonna fix your camera, is he? Yeah. Take a picture of me then. Okay, so that's the date dot done. So it is Thursday when I'm planning this. I wasn't meant to plan yesterday, but oh, the rain was just horrendous. Really was goshly awful rain. So uh, yeah, we didn't, I didn't end up planning yesterday. It was very much a movie day, um, but we've got sunshine today, so. I thought I'd jump and do this very quickly. Um, sorry, sweetheart. Yeah. So, um, on this week, the Saturday. Obviously, I'm going to have some new releases, and they will be a kit, a uh, Halloween girls kit, and I'm going to have some little functional dragon pieces as well. So that will be what is going up this week. So that should be very good. Um, I haven't yet uploaded last week's because things have been very busy with holidays and everything so I still need to upload that but I will be putting that up soon so by the time you see this one the other one will have gone up anyway. Um, I'm gonna go through and find my full boxes and my headers. I'm gonna do that a little bit differently. Um, so there's there's nine full boxes and I've got three girls, two quotes and lots of florals. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put um, I'm going to pop down the headers first. I'm just going to put the uh, today headers along first and then I'll put the full boxes in and we'll just look at those in a minute. So um, the colours in this kit are just so pretty as well. The pinks and the purples and the blues. Blue is my absolute favourite colour. Um, and um, this particular shade of blue is just so, so subtle and not at all overpowering. It's just really, really nice. And this kit works well with the colours that are already in the the planner so ah. Crowley's come to join me now don't try and drink my tea Crowley Wells um 
a dull week this week. Um, so not many plans going on, but enough to keep us busy. In terms of what's been happening this week so far, it was on Monday I went to Ikea and I purchased the uh, chest of drawers little filing cabinet that I was after. So cute, I love it to bits. It's great for storing all my stickers and planner bits and pieces in. So it meant that obviously I had to do a whole rearrange because I needed to fit it in again into like the living room. So lots of rearranging and moving furniture and it, oh, it was just such a great Monday, Tuesday <laughs> to be able to do that. Um, what else did we get up to? Oh, um, I got Kingdom Hearts 3 for my birthday, which I'm so happy about. I haven't started it yet. As soon as I'm finished tonight sorting out the artwork on my designs, I am going to be cracking it open and having a go because I can't wait. So let's have a look at my full boxes now. Um, what I might do is keep one of these floral ones to finish the top here. I'm going to build my sidebar first and then I'm going to go from that. So I need my sidebar items. Let's put this one off to the side for now. And we're going to start off at the bottom with the blue. Yeah, we'll start with the blue. And then I'm going to use a work header to mark my husband's work schedule. Um, and then I'm going to put another weekly checkbox down to mark the dip so I can keep a track of dinners for the week. Put the header down. Um, You done it. Yeah. My dad did. She's done it everybody. I don't know what she's done, but she's done it. What have you done? What have you fixed? Your camera? Yeah. Oh she's fixed her camera. Well done. You gonna finish your yogurt please before Crowley does. I got off. I got off. Cheese. I know you want batteries. I haven't got batteries for it. So I'm going to put my trackers down for my meds and my reading. Um, okay. Yeah, you got to eat your yogurt before Crowley does. So back to my full box dilemma. <laughs> it really is a, a dilemma. Um, Mommy, I'm going to put this one up here. Mama. It's fine. He's not going to eat it from there. There we go. So it says, where flowers bloom, so does hope. And I love, I think that's such a beautiful quote. So I'm going to pop this down here. And then... I've put this too far over. I need to move that across a bit. I lost them. Oh. Mommy, am I done? Are you done? Little bit. Little bit. Mommy, my little bit. Hold on, sweetheart. Get this one straight. Okay, this is gonna be my last attempt. If I don't get it straight, it's tough. My doing? Trying to get this sick dicker down straight. There we go. That'll do. <laughs> mm. Emily, you can get plenty out of there on your own. Oh, my 
And then I'm going to pop in this pretty pink washi here just to cover that bit up. And then some of this thicker floral washi up here. There we go. Okay. So I've still got eight full boxes. Um, okay, I'm going to start with the girl in this pretty dress. Cause, sorry, I love this one. Mommy, in a pretty dress? Yes, girl in a pretty dress. Yeah, I like a girl in a pretty dress. And yeah, Amy Lee apparently likes the girl in the pretty dress. That's good. Because so does Mommy. If Mommy can just get the right position for her. Right. And then I'm gonna put oh, my floor one in. Dress. She, yeah, you like pretty dresses too. My dress. Is that your pretty dress? Yeah. Oh wow. I like my pretty dress. And I'm gonna put this one in. Last one. I'm going to use this girl here. And then this one here that says bring me all the peonies. I love peonies, they're one of my favourite flowers ever. I think that's one of the reasons this kit just called to me. They're just so pretty. Oh, that looks lovely. Okay, so let's get my to-do headers down. And then we can pop in the full boxes. I'm not going to colour block. I'm going to colour stagger though. I'm really struggling today to get these lined up. Um, so, yeah, anyway, what was I talking about? Uh, next week. Last week. What week am I on? Uh, that, that is kind of how my brain is at the minute. I am so frazzled from the holidays. I just don't know where I am. <laughs> One day to the next, it seems. And I think sometimes we need to let ourselves be frazzled. You know, we are always, as mums, you're so busy running around making sure everybody else is okay that you don't always look out for yourself. So, being frazzled is a good sign that you need to stop and take a second for yourself. And if this plan with me is not an example of taking some time out for yourself, I don't know what is because I've just realised I've put a today header there. Instead of a to do. So, let's 
So there we go. That just shows you how bad it is. Um, we're starting to gear up for going back to school. Um, all the uniforms are pretty much sorted. I just need to get my son some school shoes and my daughter a backpack and then they will be ready for school. Um, yeah, so they're, they're growing up very quickly. <laughs> Soon they will be off to school. Um, oh, and I need to get my son's bus pass as well, which means I've got to take a trip into town one day and uh, get his photos done and everything so we can get his bus pass sorted out. And I don't know when I'm going to do that. It will probably be um, probably be Thursday, I think we'll go. I think, yeah, I think we'll do Thursday. And then then it's not, then it's done. It's, no, actually I want to do it before Thursday if I can. I might try and do it Wednesday because I've got to get do it depends on I don't know I've, I've got to try and fill it fit it in somewhere and uh, it involves going into the city centre to get it sorted out which is always a big stressful deal for me. Um, I suffer with anxiety, so crowded places are difficult. And um, I have OCD and one of my OCD triggers is, one of my OCD fears is germs. And so going into big crowded places, um, if I'm having a really bad attack, can leave me panicking like crazy because you know they're people they're coughing they're sick they're, and it it's difficult um i tried buying some of those reusable face masks but the problem is the shopping center doesn't accept you using them they will tell you to take them off um they see them as a, a way of trying to hide your identity as opposed to a way of trying to keep yourself safe um so if they were the disposable disposable medical ones it would be different um so i i've got to make a choice i've either got to order some disposable medical ones or I've got to really, really push myself into the discomfort zone and carry on. Um, and as I said, sometimes it's fine. Sometimes it's not an issue at all. But then there are other times when it feels like I can't do it. And to be honest, at the moment, my OCD is okay. So I probably could do it on my own. Um, but I'm not going to say 100% that I can, um, just because I'm, I've noticed I'm having a lot of fatigue, I'm having a lot of brain, I call them brain stops, where your brain just kind of tunes out for a bit, um, and you lose focus as to what you're doing, and you just kind of go on autopilot a little bit, so... I don't know, we'll see. I'll just keep keep plugging along. But it might be a case of my husband takes my son on Monday and gets it done. I don't know. Anyway, moving into the plans for this week. Um, let's have a look at what we got. So, we start off on Monday. We are having the windows repaired um by the landlord so i'm going to mark that with a 
I mean, the window's repaired and I need to take my daughter to the health visitor. So I'm going to use a half box. the window repair and then I'm going to use a plain quarter box here for the health check. Um, the reason I'm taking it to see the health visitor is we are trying to toilet train at the minute and she's not having accidents. Um, the problem we're having, oh you bought me a present, thank you. Thank you for my present. So she's not having accidents. The problem we're having is that she's not, holding she's not this. using the toilet. You're holding this, thank you. Yeah. Um, she's holding on and she will hold on all day. She will drink tons of water, but she will hold on all day until she can't hold on anymore. And then we end up with a situation where Eventually she will wet herself and I can sit her on the toilet as often as I like Just nothing seems to be working. So we're gonna go see the health visitor and see what they recommend um, Tuesday then I want to My son has sea cadets and I want to film So I'm going to use a you No, know I haven't even filled these in yet. Sorry. I've got my Stadler Tri Plus fine liner and the point three tip I'm going to use to fill this in. Hi, mommy. Hello, sweetheart. So that's uh No. Okay. There we go. Um, so my son's got sea cadets and I want to film because we're out on Wednesday so I won't get a chance to do that. So I'm going to use this half box down here to mark sea cadets and from uh, Happy Cutie Studios I've got the little Coco Sailor stickers I use for that so I'm going to pop one of these down. Um, and then I need my filming stickers. I had sorted all my stickers out and then my little ones come along and had a look. <laughs> so just bear with me two seconds. So from Georgina the Librarian, I've got these film edit and upload stickers that I'm going to use. So let's grab a little film one. I'm going to pop it on there. It's not filming my plan with me. Oh, that is so skew. Why am I not able to get my stickers down straight today? What is wrong with me? Here we go. That's a bit better. Still not great, but it'll do. Um, so Wednesday is um, my daughter's brother's birthday. So uh, my daughter has a different father to my son and my youngest daughter. And it's her brother's birthday. He's two. And 
He is such a cute little munchkin. He's got such a cheeky face. It very much looks like his dad as well. Um, so it's his birthday, so I'm going to use these little balloons from the kit. Pop them in the half box. Um, and I'll fill that in off camera because I don't know how his parents would feel about me putting his name on there. And then I want to design as well. So I'm going to use a, I'm going to use this patterned cord box here. Oh no, that's very close. To the, I'm going to use the blue one, I think. Um, and then on the kit here, there's a little, a little desk. So I'm going to use that to mark designing. Okay, so that's the first part of the week. Moving on to Thursday. I want to, Thursday I want to edit. So again, I'm just gonna use one of these larger labels here. To mark editing. And again, my librarian edit sticker um, and then I want to do artwork listings so to mark that I'm going to use this little quarter box here And there's a little computer screen here that I'm going to use off the kit. To mark the, that I'm doing artwork. So Friday, um, the only thing I want to do on Friday is um, write the artwork descriptions, uh, the listing descriptions. I don't want to put that on a half box because I get the feeling I'm going to have more coming up on Friday. So I'm going to use, I'm going to use this rounded quarter box just to pop here. Um, and then from my stash of stickers I've got from Happy Cutie Studios I've got my little laptop stickers I'm going to use a little purple one there we go and that is for the description Um, so that's all for Friday. Saturday is new releases and on the kit here she actually has a new releases sticker. So I'll pop that down straight away. Saves me having to write it in. And then I want to upload. I think I can find the stickers I've been using for my uploads. Where have they gone? Okay. There it is. <laughs> So I'm going to pop the blue one down and then from this sticker set here I'm going to just use the upload
and then Sunday we don't have any plans. Um, I'm going to pop down a weekend banner and I'm going to pop it down right at the bottom here. There we go. Oh, so that is what it looks like at the moment. I'm going to pop it into my planner in a minute so you can see what it looks like on the rings. I'm just going to go through what's left on the kit. So I've got one full box and some checklists, some washi, all the little things, some glitter washi, a few more headers, some half boxes, some labels, more half boxes, quarter boxes, flags, checklists, some functional deco, a checkbox and some flags. I'll put these into a little pouch that I keep in the front of my planner so that if anything comes up, I can always add to it. But let's pop it in so you can see what it looks like on the rings. Oh my days, that looks so pretty. It looks so stunning on these rings. I love it. Uh, this has got to be my absolute favorite spread bar my birthday spread. Um, I'm loving this, it's just so pretty. Oh, I love it. Anyway, if you enjoyed this plan with me, then don't forget to hit the like button. It really does help out the channel a lot. If you want to see more plan with me's like this, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit the bell icon so you're notified every time I upload. All right, then you take care now. Bye-bye.